Yeah, so I get asked, I get asked that a lot of, you know, how to take the next step or how to even get into it. And I, and I always say, you know, have your bigger goal in mind all the time. Never forget what your bigger goal is, whether it's to get stronger, to get better cardio or just get fitter, you know, if you want to lose weight, you know, on the day to day scale, you're probably not going to see that progression, but keep the bigger picture in mind. You know, volume gets cut back a little bit. You know, I'll stop doing workouts that could have a, an adverse effect on the next day. You know, whether there's a lot of pull ups or muscle ups and there's a big potential for tearing your hand or something like that. Where, I mean, if you tear your hand, it's going to affect your training the next couple of days. Um, so I try to avoid things like that. So, you know, the big thing over the last couple of years, you know, it didn't really happen on purpose. Kind of the tag, the, just the acronym HWPO. It got associated with me and it stands for hard work pays off. And it was something that a couple seasons ago, I just had to remind myself over and over because I'm training all year for this one weekend. And you know, like I was saying, it's kind of hard to see the progress towards that big goal. And so I just kept reminding myself, you know, hard work pays off, this will pay off, this will pay off in the end. When it comes to my nutrition, I have very little idea of what I'm doing. I don't follow a certain diet plan or uh, anything like that. Lucky for me, my fiance is an absolute incredible cook. Even the process of taking the time out of my day to prep my food, uh, she does all of it. I'm, I'm spoiled when it comes to that. I mean, if you're training day in, day out without ever taking a rest day, it doesn't matter how hard you push or train or how strong your mental game is. If your body's not performing, then you might as well just go home. But then the natural instinct of like, no, I need to fight through this, I need to be stronger than this, kicks in and then you just kind of dig in your hole deeper. It's, it's tough mentally a lot of time. I know there's a time stamp on what I'm doing, so I want to take full advantage of what I'm capable of so that when I'm at the end of my sports career, I'm not looking back at, oh man, like, could I have been capable of doing more or should I have? It's, I did everything I could and those are the results. All those experiences, you know, they can wait until after the season. You know, I have a full life after, after my sports career, but those results are forever. I train, eat, sleep. Uh, you know, a lot, a lot comes in of nerves and kind of the mental side of things, of seeing what your competitors are doing, seeing the scores they're putting up, and it's just, it's a lot of that mental grind of, nope, don't pay attention to them, keep doing what you're doing, focus on what you need to work on. Because my, my needs for training are different than the other guy, so it's focusing on what, what I need.